Hello, my lovely Scorpio. How are you, loves? I hope everybody is well. Scorpio, today we'll do your daily read for the 24th and the 25th of October. As you know, loves, this is a general read. My resonate with you, my not. Take what's yours, leave what's not. Also, Scorpio, many thanks for each of you who joined the channel. Share the thoughts. Thank you. Let's see here, loves, what we got for this overall energy for this daily and how we're moving along. All right, loves. Let's see here. We have Six of Cups dealing with a soulmate energy here. Or I feel here the memory from the past is coming back. For some of you, it's coming somebody coming back. It is somebody you, you share very great emotions. It's like when you're around that person, we're just basically thinking of them. You feel like home. For some of you, yes, you might have a dream about somebody you used to be around with. It's like a long time. Could be even a family member. Could be a relative. Could be a love interest. But I feel here is... Like, that feeling, like, just thinking, it is it is very pleasant, okay? For some of you, definitely somebody is coming back. Very much at the soul level. Did you wait this person for long? It's like a long wait. For some of you, you've been waiting for the, the right person for a long time. You've been waiting, like, for your soulmate. But I feel here was a long wait. What you manifesting here, Scorpio? A fire sign? Or are you manifesting love? Yes. Definitely soulmate energy here with somebody here. Could be with a fire sign here. Why are you so afraid here? To not be mutual or to not be in a balanced way? Or you are... Some of you might be afraid to take action towards this person. It's like, you manifested, you got it, and now why are you afraid? Because this person is telling me is the right one. It's like I'm talking with my daughter, and it's like, you wanted this, now you have in your front, and you're afraid of it. Let's see. Let's see, loves. Sag energy again. Chariot, wow. Wow, wow. Strength. Sag, Cancer, Leo, Libra. Aries, Leo, Sag, Magician. Look how many cards here. Magician, Moon, Wheel of Fortune, Libra Energy with Justice, Chariot, Strength. All major arcana. Scorpio, this person is somebody you will share share a lifetime. And you share a lifetime in another past life here. I feel here. It's somebody the universe give it to you. Also, the the bond with you, it's at the soul level. Magician, you are the magician. Even I see here a fire sign could be them, could be you. But I feel here you... Sh it's a very strong connection at the soul level between you two. Okay? And I feel here it is a new beginning here. Although, I feel here could be an earth sign who didn't offer you too much in the past. Might come back and want to talk to you. But I feel here you're looking back and it's just like we are over. You are over. I feel here you are with somebody right now. But you just kind of feel afraid to, ha to, to not be stable. Like for some of you, you have an unstable relationship in the past. But right now it's just like, should I be with this person? Should I stay single as I am? For some of you, it's just like the relationship prior to this person failed every single time. I feel here the new the it's it's coming like 
a past life soulmate here. Very strong soulmate energy here for you. Could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. We have Aries, Leo and Sag, all of them in a triangle here. Also, I definitely see movement forward. Although, we'll clarify this moon here because this is only the, the, the card I'm concerned about it here. I don't even want to clarify any cards besides the moon because I absolutely love the energy. It is kind of like, let's move forward, but I'm afraid to move forward because it could go very fast. But I'm telling you, Scorpio, this is the one you want. This is the one you want to be with. But you are concerned of your, for some of you, it's just like, should I stay single? Even I do love this person. I feel here as you manifest something as they manifest. Also, I definitely see here is not like young energy or immature. It's, it's kind of I'm talking with somebody like past 30s, past 40s kind of. The universe is moving you forward towards this person, towards the soulmate. And even you tempted to... To move forward fast is telling you yes you have the green light with the strength is just like you got this to move forward the wheel and the chariot is like a car go ahead go ahead this is the right path you can take it all three major arcana that's absolutely awesome and we have one more major arcana which is the world so basically we have seven major arcana in such a small reading. That's unbelievable. But let's see here why this moon is here. Why are you afraid here? You're afraid just like not give and take. You're afraid to... For some of you, you're afraid that tying the knot with this person will lead you to have what you want or not. Or to be in a stable relationship with them. It's kind of like will cut off from your freedom or something like that. I don't feel like nine of wands. Either you, Scorpio, either them. I feel here one of you is, is kind of afraid to live their single life or to, to get tight. Yes. For some of you, you are concerned about your finances here. Yes, absolutely. Some of you are very much thinking, is this the genuine person I need? Is this the one I need? Yeah, very much concerned. Also, for some of you here, because I feel here is you, Scorpio. You have to leave your past behind. If you have some something unresolved in the past and now you don't really know, like for some of you, you had a very bad situation in the past with somebody and you're still mourning the loss of that person or like every time in the past you love and give a lot of love, that turned out in not a very good way. I feel here now you are confused. The universe is blessing you and is telling you, look what I got for you. And you're just looking, I'm not really sure. You need to leave that behind. Okay? For some of you, you might lost somebody in the past and that kind of em emotionally threw you off. But I feel here, if you manifested a soulmate, it is right here. It is a big possibility here for you. And it is coming and you don't really know what to do. You have new love, loves. This person does love you. I feel here it is mutual love between you two. Okay? But somebody is afraid to... to it's kind of like I'm afraid to, to lose my freedom. But being in union is like you give freedom and you give space to the other person. Wow! Nine of Pentacles with Ace of Pentacles. 
is Ten of Pentacles. This could be for a long-term relationship here. It's a long-term relationship here, loves. Absolutely. I see a celebration here coming here. But I definitely see here we have just Ace of Wands. Needs a little more passion for this to move forward. But we have out of bed three aces here. This person is honest to you. They want to move forward with what it is here. For some of you, the children are a, a factor in here. And it is a talk about children here. Also, I see here, for some of you, it is a trip coming in here with the world, chariot, and the wheel of fortune. You might have a trip coming here that will be very beneficial. Okay. But I definitely see here the love is shared. The love is mutual. You might start with this person as friends because Six of Cups sometimes is since you've been kids, you know each other, you've been like together for a long time, friends, and now is love and is movement forward. I absolutely love this energy. So Scorpio, I feel here if you are afraid to live your single life, I don't feel is necessary to worry about that or if you worry about money or how that will work I feel here will be a certain balance between you two also if you have something from your past you need to clear is absolutely need to end that and also if it's somebody an earth sign in the past they want clarity to have a clean slate or basically a closure do so and move forward because I see here it is movement forward if something ends and something starts because the world we have a new cycle coming in here which shows me here very prosperous and for the long run okay also what I'm feeling here you are complementary with this person like you I'll not say mirroring each other, but it's just like complement each other. It's like a give and take. Even you a little like skeptical about that, I see it's a good outcome. Okay? This this person is for the long run, is for the long term here. Okay? Also, it tells me here in is mutual, both of you putting equal effort in this connection with the strength here okay so Scorpio I definitely see here it is a green light go ahead you manifested this either you or them but I feel here it is for the long run so loves this what I got for you I hope resonates for some of you and of course We'll see you next time. Bye for now.